Hello. It's me. Oh no, I didn't turn the guy on. Hold on. Where is he? There he is. <laughs> hello, hello, chat. Hello, startup. Hello, Antion. Hello, Scorp. Uh, <laughs> Shut the heck up, Greg. <laughs> Nobody asked you. Post gif of breadbug that says me looking for who asked. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, we're doing the thing today. We're doing, we're playing Clear All Cats 2. In fact, we're going to the basement <laughs> where the cats usually are. But hey, um, I don't actually know. I've seen one screenshot. Uh, it was the screenshot of the guy who got Yi Sang's new ego to corrode. Uh, and I know that. 6-32 is one of the boss fights because Project Moon put it in their bug announcement. But aside from that, I'm pretty much blind here. Um, I'm going to use sinking as often as possible. Oh, what in the Pecatulas? <laughs> Wait. That's strange. It shouldn't tell you what the enemies are before you go in. Oh well. <laughs> I guess what this literally is in the mirror dungeon. Okay, let's play some sinking, shall we? Uh, one thing that I did not do last week that I should have done is hey, using Heathcliff. So we're gonna use Heathcliff. I know him being underleveled is counterproductive, but I don't want to use my XP tickets to level him up. Because <laughs> that's lame. Uh, we bring new Greg, new Otis, Rodia, Yisang. I almost want to say the last one should be Faust, but I know that Ishmael is better in sinking. I'm almost tempted to bring Dietz Yisang, because I feel like that would be fun, right? And it's not like we feel anything worse. Oh, he's lower level, actually. Never mind. <laughs> I didn't realize he was only level 35. Because you saw them before? I mean, yeah, but I would rather not know what the enemies are the first time I'm playing a stage, is what I mean. Uh, is it Ishmael or, uh, Faust? No, I'm not bring Mariachi Sinclair is for support. Uh, his support passive. Which is just 10% damage. We're not actually bringing him because that would be stupid. No, I know Butler Faust is pretty good. See, here's the thing. Every single sinking ID, uh, like, sinking has the best variety of physical damage types out of, like, all of the teams. Because Heath, uh, Ishmael, and the third one, what's the other? Oh, uh, Spicebush are mostly peers. Dietchi, Yi Sang, and Rodia, Mariachi Sinclair, and o Butler Otis are all blunt focused. And then Dietchi, Hong Lu, Butler Faust, and uh, Air Greg are all slash focused. Bring Encliff? I'm going to. Wait, what? <laughs> That's wrong. Ish is good, can dodge. Yeah, I know. Ish, Ish is the obvious answer, but we also like seeing new IDs, right? We'll bring Faust, and if she sucks, we'll bring Ish. Buttless. Yeah, buttless Faust. <laughs> that is correct. Hello. Hello. Staircase descended for much longer than we had anticipated. We couldn't even guess how far we were from the bottom. It's the staircase at the top of Princess Peach's castle. There's a dark look on Sinclair's face. This is a grim reminder of our experience back in the basement of his mansion. Oh yeah, that's true. Sinclair, what happened back then? It still haunts you, doesn't it? I mean, 
He only watched his family get crucified. That's not that bad, right? He sang to the backwards long jump. No, that only helps going up the stairs. It doesn't work going down them. Yeah, I can clearly see that. Going down the stairs, you just long jump repeatedly. It's... <laughs> <laughs> A sudden yet familiar sensation tickles my head. It is soon followed by a noise just as familiar. The unpleasant sound of something approaching, dragging itself across the floor. No, crawling. No, this is... it's gotta be. Roll down the stairs, Sinclair, please. <laughs> 맞습니다. T사의 지분은 이곳과 한참 멀리 떨어져 있죠. So why are we here? 원인 없이 결과만 도출되는 꼴이다. 이런 현상이 벌어지는 이유를 모르겠군. I mean, we know why we're here. It's because there's two. Uh, bow, golden bows in the manor for some reason. 언제나 그랬지만 이해할 수 없는 상황에도 반드시 원인은 있어 왔습니다. 납득했다. Why are they having this conversation? 뭐 원인은 지하실 끝까지 다다르면 알수 있겠죠. Didn't express ego, opinion discarded. <laughs> okay. All right. What does this do? At negative 15 or higher SP, lose 10 SP. When hit, lose 2 SP and gain 1 offense level up next turn. 3 times per turn. At less than 0 SP, gain 3 attack power up. Okay. What is this music, by the way? It's incredible, is what it is. Oh, I don't like the choir. Wait. <laughs> Hopeless? That's exactly what I want. They really- like... There's usually an instrument that's prevalent in the chapter. And in this one, it seems to be the human voice, which is definitely not creepy. Bruh. <laughs> You're supposed to lose that clash? Thank you. That's actually so much SP lost. That's so good. Okay, now that Heathcliff should be good now. Over the attack power up looking ass. Uh, yeah, just kill that guy, I think. Who are you targeting? Bruh. <laughs> I think this canto has the best non-melee music. I mean, that's always going to be subjective, but it's pretty... I don't know, I wasn't a big fan of the music before this track. I'll be honest. Yo, nice. That was a really rare clash win. Wait. It feels so weird using Sun Shower Heath, by the way. <laughs> he does not feel like he belongs at all. Okay, this should be more than enough to kill that guy. Yes, you run Heath instead of uh, Hong Muller-ish because you like him? No, I'm running him because he has a unique effect for this canto. I actually really hate Sun Shower Heathcliff as an ID. But I'm running him because he works well in this canto, specifically. Hello, Pecatola Morosotatis.
Uh, I want to make sure this guy dies, and I want to make sure that this guy dies. I'm supposed to clash with Remis, but whatever. Potential funny man. This chapter made potential man live up to his potential. Every time I read that, it feels like you're trying to say that he's potentially a man, rather than he's a man that potentially has potential. Like... <laughs> He does have more potential with Edgar's passive, but also, uh, I'd rather have Edgar in the pa in the party because he's good, you know. I don't think that'll be enough. Punch him. Why is Otis so bad? I mean, I know she's at zero sanity, but. I have a headache, please send help. Alright, I'll send you three additional headaches. Do you have your opinion on the new egos in the last video? Yes, I do. They're both pretty cool, was my basic opinion. This is how you know, <laughs> by the way, that they really needed to make this ID work for this chapter. <laughs> Darn, I have no need for more headaches. <laughs> yeah, I never would have expected as much. Oh, we've got a new tier of Hia, or of Teth Pekatoa, huh? All right, bring it on. You don't scare me. With no three gloom res. What I actually should have been doing was using Gregor's ego, but don't worry about it. The bell. The bell. Oh boy. <laughs> That's fine, even if he does lose. I need to... Whatever. I need to try and get three Gloom Resonance whenever possible. Excellent. That was a lot of SP. Like, I know that Otis gets SP really easily because of her special effects. Envy version? Huh? I love Sun Shower Heath. It, if it's an Envy Pekatula, I'm going to be so upset. <laughs> Why would they wait six chapters to introduce the Envy Pekatula, dude? I would actually prefer if you lose this clash, but I kind of figured you wouldn't. Oh well. He'll lose 10 SP no matter what. I just dead brained and turned all my energy into modules. <laughs> Uh, I had this. I have the same issue. Whenever a new update comes out, I reflexively go, "Oh yeah, I gotta convert all my modules." Wait. <laughs> all right, let's see if I can't lose a clash against that guy quick. He doesn't have enough for that. Don't bother. It will wait 12 chapters for envy. Well, we'll know as soon as we get to the second wave. That's the thing. This is a short fight. So we'll figure it out. Heart sealed. Good. 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 Exactly what we needed. Ow. 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 <laughs> That's fine. We'll be okay. I'm not going to need to attack most of these guys because they're going to get hit by the AoE, but... Huh? Oh. <laughs> does Otis SP gain count Abnos as 0 SP? Yes, I believe it does. Which is why it's so fa- which is why I got 28 from the first clash. 
Losing your sense of self makes envy a hard emotion to have. I suppose. Yeah. Also, these fights are taking a while just because uh, focus fights are annoying <laughs> sometimes. Also, Heathcliff is too slow to do anything in this fight. Oh, it's a big gluttony, Pecatula. Hello. Holy crap, that's a lot of effects. Uh, if the target has 5 plus rupture, inflict 2 defense level down. Gain 1 base power for every HP healing boost on self. What? <laughs> inflict 2 rupture count. Uh, core and part both gain 5 HP. Oh my god. That's a terrifying skill. Wait. <laughs> what is it? A 3 to 15? As well? Unless this unit is staggered or part broken, take 50% less rupture damage. Hi, buddy. He has very little HP, actually, now that I look at it. I can puddle stomp him. I can also do... I don't want to use the AADD. I want to use the other one. Does my team not have enough... My team doesn't have enough lust. I might just swap to uh, Dietchi Sang. Because I need more lust for this team, it looks like. No dominatings. Okay. I like seeing new enemy types, though. That is that is very cool. Especially for enemies that people don't usually think of. <laughs> uh, that is not a good clash. Oh well. Those are going to be fun to put in the custom railway. I don't know where I'll put them, but they'll be fun. <laughs> Perish. Large gluttony Pegatilla, my beloved. It just kind of looks like a flower with teeth. <laughs> I mean, not that the other ones didn't look like that, but still. Go. Yeah, I was going to say, get tails more often, please. Destroy it. It actually did not do very much damage. Excellent. Okay. It's genuinely fine. This sucks. All of them are staggered, dang it. Just did not kill. <laughs> okay. Gluttony looks like a mini Gasipium. It kind of does, doesn't it? The Gasipium was a test, so, uh, <laughs> you know. Oh, that did not do nearly as much damage as I was expecting. Wow. It's fine. We get 10 turns to do this. It's not like it's hard. That's just Faust clashes insanely high when the target has sinking, <laughs> and that is it. Oh, he's dead. Good. Now perish. Why does Hobo Cliff have tremor burst on his skill too? Don't question it. <laughs> I literally have no idea. The Pekatula are weak, Greg. Chill. Look, <laughs> Okay. That's not where I was expect. I was expecting him to go somewhere really dark with that, but that's actually like a really common thing, I feel like. Okay, oh, hey, the door. Hmm. 
숨기고 싶은 것을 만들어 놓기엔 지하실이 최적이긴 할것 같아요. Realistically, that's the correct answer. 테스, 일기장이라도 다시 펼쳐봐. 아까처럼 안 보였던 부분이 나와 있을지도 모르잖아. 그렇게 쉽게 될 리가 없잖아. 고작 일기장인데 지하실로 가야 하는 이유가 뭔지 물어봐도. Is there something wrong with the diary, Heathcliff? 아까 단순히 착각인가 싶어서 넘어갔는데 지금 또 느껴졌어. 내가 들고 있는 일기장 말이야. 아, 뭐라 표현해야 하지? 아, 아무튼 뭔가 이상한 기분이 들었어. Opious amounts of weed found in Wuthering Heights basement. 아까 갑자기 유리창이 깨져서 놀랐을 때도 비슷한 기분을 느꼈고. He is being haunted. Heathcliff. 혹시 알아 정신 나간 소리 같지? 하지만 아니요 히스클리프 그 일기장은 보통의 잉크로 평범하게 쓰인 건 아닐 테고 생각하시는 그 의문이 사실일 수도 있다고 저는 생각합니다. 네. 무슨 이야기를 하시는 거예요? 둘 다. They're rich. They can do drugs. True. 히스클리프 직접 펼쳐보는 걸 추천드리고 싶군요. Heathcliff opened the diary with a somber expression. And once again, the ink stains on the page had transformed into a series of legible alphabets. Huh? 하지만 동시에 깨달았어. 그곳은 내가 있을 곳이 아니었다는 걸. 나는 천사들에게 다시 돌려보내달라고 엉엉 울며 빌었고 천사들은 크게 화를 내며 나를 보랏빛 꽃들이 무성한 워더링 하이츠 꼭대기로 내던져버렸어. 오케이. 그제야 나는 기쁨의 눈물을 흘리며 깨어났지. 그리고 이제야 회고해보건데 그날이 그저 꿈에 불과했다고는 생각하지 않아. 어렸을 때부터 이 저택에서 유령을 보았던 것이 결코 내 상상이 아니었던 것처럼 말이야. 그래, 우리는 천국에 있으면 한없이 비참할 거야. Already? 그러니 다가오는 죄들을 받아들이고 그 밑바닥으로 계속해서 하강하는 수밖에. 여기서도 언급되고 있어요. 우리라고. So whenever it says we, it's giving a hint, huh? 보통의 일기장에서는 1인칭을 쓰는 게 일반적이죠. 하진... 모르겠어. 난 처음 듣는 꿈 이야기야. 벅죽일 수도 있소만. 다가오는 죄들을 받아들이고 이 밑바닥으로 계속해서 하강하라 함은 내게 맞지. 이 죄종들을 모두 물리치고 지하실로 나아가라는 소리가 들리오. The other one was kind of a puzzle. This isn't a puzzle. It's just saying, keep fighting and go into the basement. So, <laughs> 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 She just didn't talk for two entire cutscenes. <laughs> Puzzle, walk forward. This might be a little too difficult. Nelly, Uncle Linton, Kunumi, Nega Punim Pionjur is Sukak Jones of Patawichana. Ne Pionjur is Takaro Chenge. 그 자식이었을까? 그래. 린트님이라면 충분히 그럴만 하셨을지도 모르겠네. 
that he's pissed at Linden, dude. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> like, none of his family members are that cool. Okay, maybe Heath isn't that good, <laughs> I'll be honest. But I do want to keep using him because it is his story. Glass pods. Oh, oh no. <laughs> We've got another new Pecatola. Okay. I almost want to switch Heathcliff out for Ishmael at this point. Like, he's only a little. I need to lose a clash on turn one, really, if I want him to be good. <sighs> Mechanical squid. Why? Oh, the Ophi is down there for some reason. <laughs> okay. Hey Jen, thank you for stopping by. The room was filled with rows upon rows of mysterious glass pods, each housing a completely still person inside. Hmm. The oomphies, <laughs> yeah. True, actually. At the end of the basement was a woman lying inside a coffin. And Heathcliff was the only one who immediately recognized her face. She appeared to be at peace, as though in a pleasant dream. Attached to the coffin was a golden bow, shimmering with the golden light we'd grown familiar with. The room, the glass pods, the chaos, nothing, none of it seemed to register for Heathcliff. He began sprinting toward the coffin like a madman. Don Quixote? <laughs> no, that was Heathcliff. Don Quixote, who I was ready to see sprinting alongside Heathcliff, was standing still, aghast. Hmm? A misunderstanding? Oh, he's she's talking about the Ufi. You're not from the Ufi, are you? You're from the ring. そっぽろの応援を<笑> Hmm. They're not from the OP at all. <laughs> the fixers began fiddling with the lab machines. I think she's angry because they're not real fixers is probably what's happening uh okay you're just gonna counter that get your sp lowered that works as many dominating clashes as i can get on turn one oh okay 
Titan's favorite either way. Take the hit that will do the least damage to you. Paint brushes? I didn't see any paint brushes. Their weapons are halberds. Everyone wants to be a new Oomphy. That's not true. I don't care about them. <laughs> Also, six target enemies. Are they going to be in this fight, actually? I just realized that could be. Stab. That did so much damage, actually. Yeah, Heathcliff is, like, not bad if you actually know how to use him. But I don't, because he, you know, was bad for a long time. <laughs> so, yeah, yeah, that's the reason I'm not good at using him, definitely. And now he has five sinking... Uh, I could just take a second hit with him. Or I could just use spread out. That works too. Uh, counter I will ignore. If possible. Can't kill that guy. He just has so much potential. <laughs> two coin counters. Yeah, two coin counters are really good. I can clash if I'm using... Spread out, because spread out gives you a ton of sinking. So I can just counter again the next turn and have my SP go back down again. That is why I attacked him three times, by the way. 21! <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, now he's actually doing well. You have to get out of the mindset of winning every clash. No, only on Heathcliff. Heathcliff is literally the only one that it, that it matters. Everybody else can just win clashes. It's not a big deal. Maybe that's enough to kill that guy. Hopefully that's enough to kill that guy. You target him. This is going to take four turns no matter what I do. Okay. <laughs> Women and men, soldiers and outlaws, fools and corpses. You are quoting Darkest Dungeon in my chat again. God. <laughs> It's a shame how this unit will fade into irrelevancy once more after this canto. Yeah. I mean, Greg's passive helps him a little, but it is definitely not enough. Whenever Uptie 5 comes out? Uh, you guys are way too excited for Uptie 5. Yeah, look, he has... Oh. <laughs> he has so much burn. Wait. Alright, Heathcliff is going to corrode. That's okay, I think. Uh, if it gets a, to be a real problem, we'll just start having him use um, no telepole equip. Because that way, I don't need to worry about hitting myself. I dread the cost of up to high five? That's correct. Alright, who, who are you corroding into? Okay, that's the good one. That's the one I can actually use. Oh, hi! Pecatulum Acidia. Piling rocks. If the target has 5 plus tremor, clash power plus 1. Like, 3 tremor count, 1 paralysis, 8 tremor, and 2 offense level down. That's a lot. And I don't get to see his passive because it's probably something confusing. That works. <laughs> Excellently done. Okay. Sure. Actually, I should clash with the faster guys first. Try to get him off the field, because I don't know what he does yet. Yeah, it does look like even if the guy doesn't have sinking, it just activates his pass. <laughs> the effect from the last hit, that's insane. You're potentially too hard. No, this is what, like, what I want. Oh. It's such a cool animation, and you never get to see it, because he never corrodes, you know? Yeah, I should just unequip Telepole so that he never accidentally uses it for this, uh, Kanto. Because that's going to be a big problem if it keeps happening. But now he's going to heal a lot. Uh, you don't need to counter. At this point, I can just kill things, thankfully. No 
And I need one for that guy too. That'll work. Perfect. Okay, I wasn't expecting that to kill, honestly. Agar skill 3 can final can activate. Yeah, you told me earlier. It's really weird. You have Sunyata equipped? Yeah, what I'm saying is I should unequip his he ego. Because it's multi target, so it'll hit allies if I do activate it. This way. Because you don't want to accidentally hit your team using telepol. Or whatever. We're for get ever getting charge potency? No. <laughs> Why would we get charge potency? It doesn't do anything. Greg, of course, is the winner. Faust is not very good at damage, it seems. Imitations. Two unknown enemy types. Gee, I wonder what they're gonna be. <laughs> okay, yeah. Let's unequip that so that we don't accidentally use it. And then let's go. Charge us harder. <laughs> Such hours is so fun, I don't mind. He's not great. Yeah, he's a fun ID. He's just bad. いらそのなんでのことだよ。ウェチェジョクデ。ハウスティア。ナイスナイス。ウリジュンカジャンユヌヌアミロ。モデンゴルクエトルクイヌンクデラミアン。で、アマチュンブニアルコシラセンガカオ
필요 내가 일부 설계하였다고는 하나 그 당시 내 벗들의 조력 없이는 결코 이루지 못했을 okay, He's either concerned about Gubo or Sang Yi Probably Sang Yi it looks like Yi Sang falls silent unable to finish his sentence He faces forward That man is uh, Who the heck are you? I okay. You're from N Corp, so that's already bad. He's talking in a poem. He's one of Yi Sang's friends. 침묵만큼 괜찮은 답은 없겠지. 그대가 그 시절 침묵을 가까이 했듯이, 그렇지? 이 광경들을 보고도 그리 태연하게 말할 수 있는 것이라면, 그대는 이미 이 모든 장면들을 일찍이 보아오고 있었나 보군. 아세아. 뭐. 온전히 내 결심으로만 비롯된 일은 아니었네. 자네도 알지 않나. 내가 이 정도의 야망이 있는 그릇까지는 아니었다는 걸. I don't remember his name from Yi Sang's chapter. It was probably there, but. 이봐, 함부로 얼굴을 드러내면. 응? Hmm? 이미 다 알려진 마당에 뭘 그렇게 숨기기 급급하나. 추하게. 당신은 이전부터 정말 지긋지긋 <웃음> 이번엔 기필코 그분들에게 낱낱이 보고를 <웃음> Uffy? The ring? <웃음> like... 그분들이라 재밌군 도슨트들을 말하는 건가? 아니면 마에스트로? Of course she knows 무슨 말을 하는 거야 류쇼 그 명칭들은 분명 말했지 저것들은 이상하다 I remember Ryoshu telling the Ofi Association fixers to stop, that there was something off about them. Then... We know. Is it Don? An imposter? Among us? Oh, here we go. Mad researcher of the ring? Question mark? Enamored researcher of the ring, question mark. Yep. It's the ring. A little unsurprising there. Bleed. Oh, they're bleed. Oh, God, there are a lot of bleed. Uh, <laughs> that's a lot of bleed. It's, uh, it's literally just one more coin power on each skill. The unit your has remaining shield at turn end. Gain three damage up. Okay. Well. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> that is a dangerous skill. Inflict rupture equal to bleed? Why are you like this? <laughs> okay. Actually... See, the problem is I do want to use spread out. <laughs> Why does it say 4 plus 2? Oh, because they're two different enemy types. So they're going to be slightly different. Okay. They're weak to slash, yeah. Oh, he literally has a skill called Brush Stroke. They are just the ring. There's no pretense at all. Please stop losing clashes. You're the worst. Um... <laughs> That's okay, it'll be fine. I really wanted Puddle Stomp to go after, though. But that's okay, I guess. I did not lose that much sanity there. <laughs> oh, you know what? 
No, I can't use his ego because I don't have enough lust. <laughs> Dang it. This is the type that is going to suck getting in Sinking Team, is getting lust. You, like, have to run DXC, uh Sang. Pretty much. Oh, I didn't look at any of their passives, did I? <laughs> I should probably do that. I just know that if they block and you don't break their shield, they end up with damage up, which is a little dangerous. That guy has 26 sanity. God. Uh, passives. In a clash, clash power plus one. Great. Uh, heal two SP on self on hit against targets with bleed. Okay. That's fine, actually. I am not going to use both. That would be a mistake. Albert is a big heavy weapon. Paintbrush is like a thin blade. Yeah, but like if you looked at the OP weapon that like uh, Heathcliff had, they're not that different. Hi guys. This is all just grunts, by the way. I realize. Hopefully he doesn't get killed for that. That's fine. What did they resist pierce, don't they? That's what it looks like. Yeah, they do resist Pierce. That's fine. Them being weak to Slash is big cringe. Because <laughs> it's just like, oh yeah, use all of the new IDs we've been doing. I mean, it's only this uh, banner, though. Can't wait to fight them in Mirror Dungeon 4. I mean, they probably won't even be that bad. That's the thing. You have to keep in mind that, like, they're not like the middle. They don't roll absurdly high for no reason. They just kind of exist. But aside from that, they're fine. Fight's over. I mean, like, that's actually a really easy fight for what you'd expect from the ring. But the director is going to be a boss fight, yeah. I'm out of lime soda. <laughs> Yeah, he's just not doing a great deal. That, why are you like this? It's all just the buffed ones, man. This fight's gonna suck. What about the butlers? Uh, well, the butlers we already fought. Just for Butler Faust, her lust skill? Yeah, but like, you know what I mean, though. <laughs> Let's be real here. Struggling? Oh god, this fight is gonna be ass. I can already tell. I can't even have Heathcliff clash with that guy either. So I'll just have him attack. It's not a big deal. I want you to get sanity quick, because you're really good at getting sanity anyways. I mean, the... the... Buffed Acidia don't really seem that dangerous. It's the Goulet that scares me. Okay. What a great clash. <laughs> Just <laughs> shove his face into the floor. <laughs> That's all you need to do. I'm getting like all tails, pretty much. Okay. Bruh. Alrighty. What do you resist? Hold on. That guy. Oh. I don't want you to clash, though. <laughs> That's the thing. Yeah, this team really needs to use Fluid Sack. 
Like, as soon as I have the ability to use Fluid Sack, I should. In every fight, pretty much. Oh, that's unfortunate. Fine. Just so I have sanity. I don't even care about the HP. Lightly moist Gazipium. I hate you. I hope you know. <laughs> so I can use ADD. Ah, it did day. Um. Oh, he's just blocking. Free protection, bro. Okay. Epic. I did not expect that to kill. That's fine, though. <laughs> this fight is going to take a while, because these guys are surprisingly bulky. Like, what the heck? I mean, I killed two of them that turn, but still. Not the far one. Greg's new ego SP is yeah. Greg's new ego is SP healing, but the problem is it's going to target. What one of the targets will always be Heathcliff. Oh, that was just a one wave fight. What? <laughs> Alrighty. Wasn't expecting that. Maybe that's why they were so bulky. Incredible. Yeah, it looks like Heathcliff is still kind of bad. Two new enemy types. Pardon me? <laughs> okay. Oh, no. <laughs> Wrong button. Two new enemy types. That's not good. Protect the gluttony boy. <laughs> no. No. But these aren't new enemy types, game. <laughs> Why are you like this? It was a terrible start, by the way. Uh, and of course, none of the enemies are targeting Heathcliff, so there's no point in countering. I don't like that they just default get one clash power, by the way. It's really rude. Get Luigi. DM really likes reusing this specific theme. I mean, this theme is important, though, for stuff. Yo! <laughs> that clash, that evade had no business working that well. Okay. Uh, you just counter, because now they actually will hit you. And that's good. For some reason. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> The bleed is gonna suck, but that's fine. He's a tank, he'll be able to deal with it. When are we gonna get another five coin skill? Most pathetic clash ever. I know, he just flipped tails every single attack. That's 70 bleed damage, by the way. <laughs> I just hope you guys know this. So no matter what Heathcliff does, he's about to take a ton of damage. And there's nothing I can do to stop it, because I'm too lazy to stop it. <laughs> I mean, you know, spread this. Perish. Perish again. Uh, he just gained so much sanity by doing that. <laughs> it's fine, he'll be okay. How is there a guy alive? That's very strange. Alright. <laughs> the only HP that matters is the last one. True, this is Yu-Gi-Oh, after all. You're locked into countering with him? That's not true. I have Fluid Sack. I mean, I don't. Because <laughs> I'm not generating enough Envy this time. But I could just do this. Because Bygone Days is cool. Uh, yeah, just counter, I guess. <laughs> Countering is legitimately just a good idea with him, though. That's the thing. If you don't have spread out, you might as well counter. Or maybe Puddle Stomp is good, too. But don't worry about it. Caught the stream just in time, yippee. 
four damage up bygone days. That's pretty sick. We did 29. Epic. Okay. Still sanity. Oh, wait. I forgot that he could get staggered. Uh, rest in peace, Heathcliff, I suppose. <laughs> That's fine. We'll be okay. Very tempted to just switch him for Diet Si Hong Lu at this point. He is not pulling his weight. At all. Oh, wow. That's not a great start. You just evade. I think we'll be fine without him, honestly. Unless the game forces us to bring him, which I don't know if it will, because honestly, that game does do that sometimes. <laughs> he died of Ligma. <laughs> These guys hit like trucks. They do hit pretty hard, yeah, but they're not that dangerous, all things considered. They are just, like, single target enemies. They're not that big of a deal. Kick. I love kicking the enemy in the forehead to kill him. He needs to be here for the deep lore. <laughs> needs envy for passive. Yeah, my team doesn't have a lot of envy. That's true. Oof. Yeah, wait a minute. <laughs> I was going to say, the thing did not load properly there. No cutscene on either of those. Huh. Yeah, the problem is I'm not building... Uh, enough envy to do anything. He really needs an envy counter. All things considered. I'm not bringing Sinclair. <laughs> That's a terrible idea. Do I just leave him? I feel like I want to just leave him. We learned that the ring is several sections for each one specializes in not only in different art form, but also combat method. Did we learn that? Was that from Leviathan? I I'm sorry. I'm leaving him behind. I don't... He's not good enough. <laughs> he's just not good enough. I'm sorry, chat. <laughs> What do you mean Hong Lu instead of Yi Sang? You know Yi Sang has an AoE sinking ego. <laughs> Don't leave the funny British man. I'm leaving him behind. Uh, though if I'm leaving him behind, he should have a different ID equipped so he doesn't <laughs> do stupid things. There's like... Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me? You were planning on sacrificing me? I'll miss him. Mom,主席，阿谁啊？我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，我，
hello. Is it still just the same? Yeah, it's still just the same enemy types. It's kind of lame, honestly. <laughs> I would have liked to have seen a named guy from the ring. But I guess it's okay. Yeah, if you get unlucky at the start of the fight, these guys will just kick your ass. Because <laughs> they, they have so many coins. So if they get really lucky at the start, they just kill you. <laughs> And it seems like Yi Sang never has any trouble flashing, which is nice. You know what would be cool? I should bring Reindeer in this team, actually, now that I think about it, because Reindeer is just fun. And she has Envy, so... Okay. No, 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 we don't use it. <laughs> we use we use this skill one, that's what we have to do on him. 26, what? All these things, friends, have a terminal case of poetic nonsense. <laughs> True. Ow. Ow. That's fine. Perish, idiot. <laughs> this is why we bring Diet Chi Hong Lu, by the way. He's just really good. He does so much damage. Why did I use Rodia's skill one? Well, it was because I needed to get uh, three Gloom Resonance, of yeah, course. I'm sealing his heart. <laughs> is true allegiance really is unknown? I mean, who? Oh, Asya. Yeah, I guess. It's a pretty good skill lineup. Mm, yeah, that's good enough. I mean, I don't need five. <laughs> Uh, this would be a really good turn to use Yi Sang's Ego if I had it charged up. What am I missing for it? One Sloth. Epic. Well, I'll have it for next turn, anyway. Yeah, Diet Chi Hong Lu is, um, a little good. <laughs> I think. I don't know, he seems pretty decent. And I staggered. Fog. Oh, hey, Gregor gained the coin boost. Yeah, he, he just does that sometimes. <laughs> He's a pretty good ID. Like, really, really good, honestly. New Greg is insane. You really got two tails at 45 sanity? <laughs> Incredible. There, fight over. <laughs> But yeah, if I ever get bored of Faust, I'll just bring Reindeer. Because she's also sinking. Must we consider him a triple agent? No, I don't think Sonya's a triple agent either. Is Faust good? Faust is decent. She's not amazing, but neither is any two star for the most part. 40%? I mean... He got 40%, but Greg was not that far behind. <laughs> so. Imitations 4? Bruh. How many imitations are we gonna fight? Uh-oh. <laughs> this is gonna have the boss. Oh. Yeah, I guess. So 629 is a boss fight? He's a quintuple agent? Doubt. Oh! Pointillist researcher of the ring. Hi there. One to four speed, huh? Uh, there's one skill we don't see. A five to fifteen evade that gives attack power up. Uh, I see. That's a really dangerous. If the target has 5 plus bleed, reuse the skill on a random enemy after attack. Oh, but only on Clash win. I see. Huh. <laughs> um. I guess I have to offset this, huh? Because it just rolls really high. 
You just do, fav do a favored clash. That's all you need to do. This sucks, because no matter what I do, it's going to be neutral, so I guess target that guy. Hey, hey, hey. Um, and then we just do dominating clashes whenever we can. Can I get a dominating on that with anybody else? No. Okay, then we do the favored one against it. He is not going to be fun, I suppose. Actually, this will probably be fine. Like... Plus one clash power. I should look at the rest of his passives, maybe. As well. That would be fine. Doesn't the boss have passives? Yeah. Okay, it's mur- Somebody put on the Mad World soundtrack for this. <laughs> okay, that's not great. Um... <laughs> okay, he lived. He didn't get to discard his skill 3 anyway, so he's not good yet. Right, what are his passives? When an ally is defeated, gain a slot. That's fine. When all allies, including this unit, heal 3 SP on Clashwind. Okay, that's not a big deal. Ah! <laughs> okay. This is at least a good skill now. Actually, this is a dominating Clash, no matter what it goes up against. <laughs> I'm not going to let the game lie to me about that. Like, I know better. Not clashing. Evade him. Oh, I forgot to deal with the evade. Uh, <laughs> Don't worry about it, I guess. Come on, man. <laughs> He's gonna have two attack power up next turn. I'll have to use an ego. Oh no. <laughs> it's, like, it's literally just not that big of a deal. It's actually. Okay, that's not great. It's actually a little better if we don't kill the minions because then he has fewer skills to get bonuses from the attack power up, I guess. Oh no, it's attack power up current turn. It's fine. Bruh. Bruh. Okay. That could have gone better. Hi. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> that's, um... That's not nice. Megan, I'm getting muddy in there. Well, you're fatal to Pierce. That's not good. Uh... Okay. Really, that doesn't even offset. There. And now, let's just stagger him before he gets to attack, I think. <laughs> I, I believe that that is the safest play for me to make here. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to stagger him. I guess, no, I think I will. He doesn't have that much stagger left. Yeah, we're fine. Okay. Yeah, I, I would really rather he just didn't do any of what it said he was going to do. If I'm being real with you, chat. Like, why would I have allowed that? Now, for the other two, I don't exactly know what the best course of action is, but I know that what I just did is going to help. Uh, I think gonna start. Oh. <laughs> for a dominating clash against him. Uh, let's do some damage to the guy. I'm not going to kill him this turn. I know that for a fact. I could if I wanted to full target him. I didn't mean to clash with that skill. That's unfortunate. Oh well. They have like a bunch of stagger thresholds <laughs> for some reason. Of how you every attack triggers the stagger sound when you first stagger the guy. Yeah, it's kind of weird, isn't it? Okay, he's not doing anything. I don't really care if he has damage up. We can just kill the boss this turn. If I offset the evade. Well, I mean, offset it with Faust, probably. <laughs> the others could actually do real damage. There. Easy bosses. Easy boss fights.
And it's actually perfect, too. Oh, I didn't have enough Shredder to do the thing. That's fine. He's not dead. That's interesting. Okay. I swear if she loses that class, I'm going to be so upset. I don't have a good clash against the other guy, unfortunately, because he's doing a strong skill. But whatever. Perish. Sick. Okay. We're in the clear. Guess really did just sink the difficulty curve. Killing the boss does not end the fight. So a minion takes its place. Yeah, I know. That's a little strange that they just changed position, but... Yeah, no, I mean, that fight, I don't even think it would be hard without sinking. You just run, um, Blade Lineage, and then it's fine, because they're weak to Slash. Ryoshu stomps one of the fleeing enemies with a swift swing of her scabbard. Hmm. <laughs> What's the ring? The middle's neighbor or something? <laughs> I mean, you could call him that, I guess. などちゃるもるのんでパンツンチョンシンながんちょじきや。くにゃんあるんだおんごらめんさじょくもすのねでりだっこ。さぎでっきりゲロでるおにゃんいっそ。さぎまにさくもちょんしあんだごんはじ
지금까지 어디 있었어? 대들의 비치들이 어떤 꼬라지로 돌아다니는 줄 알아? 심지어 이상한 말도 들었어. 대들의 비치들이 오래 전에. 오, 진정해, 스플리터. 이건 내 집이었어. 이런 먹은. 건다 이긴 게임이었는데 그 망할 셰트가 갑자기 급패를 했지만. <웃음> 하지만 핸들리 씨 이런 문제는 좀더 깊이 생각해봐야 한다고 제가 말씀드렸지 않습니까? 인생이 갑자기 유별나게 틀어지고 있다 싶으면 분명 그 원인이 어딘가에 몰래 숨죽인 채로 처박혀 있을 거라고. Oh, is he? He's doing the thing where he's making Hindley believe that Heathcliff was responsible for him losing the manor, isn't he? <웃음> 맞아. 곰곰이 생각해보지 언제 어디서부터 잘못 태어난지 처음부터 잘못 띄워진 단추 그 하나 때문에 모든 게 틀어진 거였어 응? 그날 바람이 뒤지도록 많이 불던 겨울 that thing when corombing it oh yep 부서진 바이올린 조각과 함께 내 앞에 나타났을 때부터 with the br he didn't have the violin when he flipped showed up so he's actually not talking about Heathcliff right now he's talking about somebody else okay let's say what girl in touch Nobody 아니! 나 정도면 <웃음> Dude He is literally delusional 설사 당신이 과거에 육체 시술을 받았고 아버지에 의해 기숙학교로 보내진 뒤 전투에 대한 훈련을 받았다고 해도요 Hindley glared at Matthew with a look of reproach for a moment as though he was about to lash out for him for cutting his sentence short then scoffed <웃음> 난... 이 저택의 주인이었던 놈이야. 네 놈들 같이 저택을 노리고 기어 들어온 잡배들이랑은 다르지. 너희들은 내 뒤에나 붙어 있던가. 저 새끼를 내가 죽여버려야 하니까 말이야. Okay, now he's talking about he. <웃음> now he's talking about Heathcliff. Uh, but he's not in this fight. Because we already saw what enemies were in it, so. I hate this starting hand, by the way. It gives me this way too often on Hong Lu. It's really annoying. <laughs> I'd rather just block. <laughs> like. Oh yeah, this team is also sick because I can get the attack power on Ishmael. <laughs> can we please stop yapping? Nobody cares. <laughs> Especially about the card game, true. True. Nobody cares about the card game except him. Yeah, it's really easy to get the attack power up on Ishmael with this team. So, we're gonna do that a lot. Okay. Not this turn, though, because she's not gonna get an attack off. Oh, I thought it was four waves for a second. <laughs> that would have been really interesting to try to FX clear. Yeah, I'll take one attack power up, sure. The Hindley would have had to be the manor if he wasn't a <laughs> drunk. Yeah, true. <laughs> Got stuck at Love Town and went down a dark path. <laughs> true. I don't know if Hong Lu's dodge discards. It does. It absolutely does. That's why you really don't want to use it if I, if you're at three insight. Okay, 
And now we just win rate. <laughs> it didn't even use Mind Whip. <laughs> you like how fast Gregor's animations and skills are? It's nice to have an ID that's really good and also has fast animations for once. Bro, <laughs> it's fine. That's not what she's here for. Obsidian Grass. What a name for a chapter title. Three enemy types. It's Slash? Wait. The dead rabbits aren't weak to Slash. Hmm... Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Fine, we have plenty of slash in the team, I suppose. They're not gonna resist one. Linton really is just hearing of the battle and not interacting at all? Yeah, kinda. Oh, they're weak to lust, too? Well, they were only weak to the others. I really wish I could see what was left there. I'll just use a skill three. Or skill two. Again. Well, they do resist slash. Wait a minute. But they're just suddenly not weak to blunt anymore. What the heck? That's so rude. What's up, Midlow? How are you? Ow. Okay, that's fine. Ishmael losing a clash is not the big a big deal. Actually. Ishmael losing 15 sanity this turn would be though. So I'd rather she did not do that. If I get the opportunity, I'm gonna use Yi Sang's corroded bygone days just so I can see what it looks like, because I haven't actually seen the animation yet. Ishmael! Stop taking damage, you nerd. What? Oh, I'm stupid. I was supposed to discard that, not use it. Oh well. It's okay, I'll have one next turn, I guess. So it'll be kind of okay. Do not bully my wife. Too late. Do you not like fish or do you just not have her? No, I have her. But I didn't feel like using her. <laughs> I like reindeer more. Oh, there goes my sanity. Hello, Hindley. On hit, gain offense level up next turn. If the target has offense level down, deal 20% of damage as bonus blunt damage. You'll SP on self, epic. Um, <laughs> target is two offense level down, base power plus one. If the target has offense level down, deal 30% more damage. Where are you inflicting offense level down? Ah. The target has three plus negative effects, reuse this coin? That's a lot of damage, by the way. <laughs> That is a scary skill. Gain 20 additional shield HP for every surviving other ally. Okay. When in panic, reset SP. Yep. If this unit is at 10, minus 10 or less, gain three offense level up next turn. When an ally is defeated, gain one slot. Every time an ally is defeated, gain two offense level down starting next turn. If this unit wins, wins after five plus clashes, deal 50% more damage. Gambler. Okay. Um, let's see what this looks like, because I think I can hit the requirement. Oh, never mind. I don't have enough sloth. Uh, whatever. <laughs> I just won't do it then. Over that. And actually use the right skill this time. I don't know. Hindley doesn't seem that dangerous. <laughs> like, he seems really strangely weak. I like how Matt is just not helping him, by the way. <laughs> He's just not participating in the fight at all. 
Check sanity? Yeah, I should have checked sanity. You're right. Oh, well. Now I can do the big... Sorry, why did Ishmael lose sanity there? That's weird. Uh, oh, it's just the basic boss sanity? Yeah, it's just the basic boss sanity. It's no big deal. What do you mean? Oh, God. I want to see what it looks like, dang it. And I'm afraid I'm going to kill all the enemies this turn. <laughs> I mean, Hindley will live, at least. Oh, well. Who's just watching? Hindley's a little bitch, baby. It's true. <laughs> he is kind of lame, isn't he? Like, he's not dangerous in any sense of the word. He does nothing. <laughs> he has a lot of defense, I guess. That's it. That's all he does. He just has defense. And he's about to panic, too. Ooh, <laughs> rip that guy. <laughs> okay, can I use Yi Sang's shit now? Yes. Okay. I want to see what it looks like. And I can mind whip, too. That's cool. I mean, now the... <laughs> Gloom resonance doesn't matter, because I don't have any multiple enemies to target. But, oh well. You mean he is actively panicking? Yeah, he is. <laughs> he really, really do be panicking, though. He doesn't resist blunt, which is strange. Everyone excited to see him in the Mirror Dungeon 4 hard as an end boss for some reason? Because I feel like they would do that with him. That's less nightmare fuel than Gregor's. I'll say that much, at least. <laughs> I want the triple Guido boss to return. <laughs> there. Rip Hindley. We didn't even need to fight Linton. I mean, you say that, Plin Fan, but, uh, Shmi is a Mirror Dungeon boss, so, like... <laughs> I don't know what that means. No! <laughs> Good question, Ishmael. Hindley가 저희와 싸우도록 그리고 화를 내도록 부추기는 것처럼 보이는 거죠. 그리고 검은색 풀이라는 건뭘 뜻하는 거야? 모르겠어. 검은색 클로버를 말하는 거야. Black clovers? Poker의 카드. 클로버 카드. Oh. 색깔 말이야. Clubs. Okay. He's talking about clubs. Because what was it? A queen of clubs that made him lose his house or something like that? I'm not reading the chat that much because I don't want people to spoil stuff for me. I know that the next fight is a boss fight. Because PM put it in their update notes and I need to use another box. You're within 10 turns, huh? You! <laughs> you piece of garbage. PM, why are you doing this to me? Fine. We'll bring bad Heathcliff. <laughs> what was the... Hold on, what was the weakness? Nothing. Okay, that's that's great. 
Who do I leave behind? I probably just leave Ishmael behind. Bring the boy. <laughs> yeah, I know it's the last box I'll need. There aren't as many stages as last week. Oh, actually, if this is a boss fight, the order of my team doesn't matter. Tenhyundli <laughs> fusion dance? Kind of doubt. <laughs> My man really do be distorting, huh? <laughs> Yep. Hindley begins flailing his arms at nothing, then speaks into the void. Mm -hmm. I mean, we knew one of them was going to distort in the chapter. He's distorting. <laughs> Thank you, Dante. <laughs> What? He said that? He really said that? That's very mean. No, I know his father did. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Merceau, can you stop like this like you did last time? <laughs> Dang. Plot armored. Monorisitewan <laughs> Man really did just go, you know what? No French allowed. <laughs> then. I mean, that was true to begin with. You don't own the building. <laughs> Jenna, <laughs> 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 They do name drop it. Well, we're in the building. <laughs> well, Vader spotted. How are you? Oh. I see. <laughs> so. Hello there. Hindley the Reeved Lamenter. <laughs> How are you? 
core in part heal by 10% of the damage dealt. I hate this already. Uh, gain attack of its level up and haste. Epic. Inflict bleed. Epic. If this unit speeds faster than the targets, clash power plus two. This unit has remaining shield, HP, at turn end. Gain four protection next turn. Oh, cute. I so see you've gotten to the distorted Hindley. Yeah, he's here. He's here. Oh, yeah, passives, passives. If in panic, reset SP to zero. This unit's panic type does not change when inflicted with an effect that changes panic types. Instead, this unit is inflicted with an effect that is inflicted against targets without SP. What? Uh, HP does not drop below 40% for one turn. Gains a new pattern. After the first recovery from Stagger and after Clash Wind, deal 10% of the damage dealt on hit as Wrath bonus damage. On kill, heal 200 HP for core and part. Gain one haste, three defense level up, and two offense level up. That's fine. I just won't let him kill me. Uh, <laughs> Bad start for Hong Lu, as usual. Opposed. Dang it. Who's that targeting? It's targeting Rodia? That's good enough. Uh, Heathcliff, unfortunately, is just not good for this fight because he's weak to slash. Uh, that's okay. You can attack that, I suppose. Everybody else needs to clash to get their sanity up. Are you kidding me? <laughs> okay, maybe Otis will not clash to get her sanity. Wait, this sucks! Hold on. What about one of these? No, he's actually just getting attacked twice. Um. Okay. Epic. Let me undo everything and see what's going on. Yeah, uh, okay. Uh, Greg can redirect one. Because he kind of has... It has to be one of the ones that's being duplicated. It has to be the first one. Okay. And you target this. Uh, you target that, I suppose. You're unfortunately not able to clash. Neither are you. And then you, I guess, tar Man! <laughs> Why? He, she's being targeted somewhere. What, what attack is targeting her by default? Because I want her to clash. Okay. There, there, there. That's the most clashes I can do in the turn. So I just have to let him hit me, unfortunately. Actually, I want to use this. It does more damage. Also, I was actually going to walk the dogs, but I'm going to leave the stream on to bless the algorithm singularity. I appreciate that. Because <laughs> the algorithm singularity doesn't like me, for whatever reason. He actually has a really high stagger threshold. So this is the wolf, then. This is what Heathcliff is in the mirror world. From the looks. Which is interesting. Oh, I just had such a good idea. <laughs> for the um, custom railway thing. Because I was going to have Matt be in a level with Papa Bongi. Because they're both animal hats. Like in Hotline Miami. What in the god... <laughs> if the target has less than 70% HP, Clash Power Plus 2. Oh, epic. Um, Cool. I like that. You are getting targeted, and so you are going to spread out. I hate you. <laughs> I actually hate you, Hindley. Fast evade, piece of shit. Um, I can't even offset it either because it's six speed. You can't clash. I mean, you wouldn't be able to anyways, right? No, oh, that's not a good clash. Oh well, I have to deal with it. Dominating favored. Do I have a better clash against that? Uh, yes. Hang on. It's still just favored. Okay. There. Yeah, sinking is kind of really good in this fight, huh? Because <laughs> he is just a sanity boss. Okay, that's not a great Otis. I swear to God. I've never gotten so unlucky before. Finley distorted to gain anti-potential man technology. I mean, that's not exactly true because he's not that 
big of a counter to Equip. He just does slash damage, you know? I would really appreciate not getting heads every single time on him, though. <laughs> We are not hitting very hard. I, d I don't know how I'm going to do this in under 10 turns. Oh, what now? Prioritizes Heathcliff. <laughs> Epic. Um, if the target is the enemy with the slowest speed. Oh, that's not good. Can it, can it be redirected, though? Yeah, there's nothing that says it can't be redirected. What does Mark Prey do? Um... Same turn bind, Pog. <laughs> With every hit this unit takes, take bonus slash damage equal to 10% of the HP damage taken. So, take 10% more damage. If this unit does not take damage during the turn, inflict one inferiority complex after the attack, and then expires. Okay. <laughs> cool, we have another status effect. Why does it have so much more text here? Oh, it's scrolling the effects. Okay. okay. This is actually a good turn. That is not the right ego. <laughs> I could rhyme shank. I need to not lose the clash against it. Is the problem. Also, he's using his guard again, which is sick. Uh... He's weak to four attack types, by the way. Wait, hold on. Realistically, yeah, that's not going to win that clash. And if I lose a clash against it, it's going to do a lot of damage to me. I should just redirect it. There's no reason for me not to. Just by accident but I didn't notice in time, it made me really upset. Oh, use AEDD instead of uh, <laughs> the actual good one. Yeah, I can see that. It, it, it's like annoying when it happens, but it's a pretty... Stream freeze? No, it didn't freeze, it's still going. I looked at his sanity. I know he doesn't get affected by Echoes of the Manor. I pay attention. I'm not stupid. We staggered him anyways. Who cares? Yeah. Gain one offense level up on Clash win. Gain one defense level up on Clash lose. Gain two haste next turn. But he's not going to Clash with anybody because I staggered him. I know he gets affected by the other effect. He doesn't even have it yet, by the way. <laughs> This is a terrible stagger turn, as well. So I have all of my worst skills possible. Uh, I might just use this. It's slightly less damage than skill one, but it's fine. I want the passive effect. Please stop flipping only tails, Otis. <laughs> like, I get it, but still. Oh, he had paralysis. Oopsies. Game is rigged. Look at all that potential from potential, man. Yeah, but why? Okay. There. Inferiority complex. Every time this unit takes a hit, take 20% of HP damage taken times one damage. Oh, he can have more than one of it. Okay. Now I can use this. Which I want to do, because I want sanity. <laughs> Did that skill gain coin power? No, that's a different skill. Okay. What? Unclashable? Hmm. That's fine. I don't give a shit. <laughs> Who cares? Let's 
struggling. I don't really want to get inflicted with bleeds. Like, you know. I have to make a poor clash with Heathcliff this turn, unfortunately. Actually, my clash with Otis is going to be slightly better because she's getting some SP back from Gregor. I don't think I saw the unclashable when I did this fight. I know it's dodgeable, but that attack isn't going to hit that hard, is the thing. So it doesn't really matter. Also, we're halfway through the turn limit, by the way. <laughs> I don't know how exactly you would do this in under 10 turns if this just isn't the way to do it. Because, okay, I didn't really want to win the clash, but I'll take it. Ow. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> Alright, that was not that big of a deal. Alright, at least break his shield, thank you. I think we won't have a trouble doing that, though. Oh, here we go again. Um, the evade is fine. I'm actually going to use this just so I have less sanity. Because I'm, I'm like that, okay? Otis, have a better skill for God's sake. I swear to God. <laughs> she is so useless sometimes, man. Sinking makes this fight a joke? Yeah. No, I think I'll be able to EX clear it because after a certain amount of damage, he's going to get staggered again and then we'll just kill him. So it's not that big of a deal. Sinking really does make this fight a joke, huh? Doing this without sinking might be legitimately da dangerous. I should have overclocked it. Oops. My bad. This will take care of the evade, though. Do not call my beautiful wife useless. What, Heathcliff? He's pretty useless in this fight. <laughs> I'll be honest, he's not doing that much. Also, pay off for the one Gloom Fragility. Oh. We're not done. Oops. Don't care who PM says, I am not running sinking. <laughs> by the end of the season, all the support passes turn Suncliff into the honored one. <laughs> no, because he's going to have an ID for uh, Hindley. I told you it was Hindley. I told you Heathcliff was Hindley. Like, that's the shaded face in the Otis ID thing. No, Hindley is not Gregor. Linton is Gregor. Fourth Thunderbolt? <laughs> Julian, 
나는 오빠가 건강해질 수 있도록 내 모든 힘을 다할 거야. 하지만 오빠가 모든 기회를 걷어차서 스스로 그 구렁텅이를 향해 걸어가는 걸 택한다면. <웃음> we will have Catherine Heathcliff ID. My uncle works at VM. <laughs> 헤이! Hey. <laughs> oh look, there's the prioritizes Heathcliff again. Um, I can probably win that clash, but it's still better to just not bother. <laughs> Papers. Okay. Like how the music just becomes sad now. Sick. Sick. <laughs> I mean, I don't want more clash steps, but I will take a clash win, that's for sure. I bet for the rest of the Kanto, we're forced to use Heathcliff, huh? I wouldn't be surprised anyway. My uncle is John PM, and we will be getting Kathy Yi Sang. <laughs> Why, though? Why would that fit Yi Sang in any way? He's just barely not staggered. Okay. We'll be next turn, though. Because bygone this day, I throw shards of glass into his eyes. That is my strategy. Yi Sang's using his pocket glass. Okay. I don't know if we kill this turn. But it's gonna be close. I could body sag. That would be funny. But I don't think I will. I don't know. I don't think we're killing this turn. We'll need to use the rest of the fight. Oh well. Pocket glass. <laughs> really do be pulling a king of the hill with that one. Um, not even really. I mean, glass... Sand turns into glass, so it's kind of like pocket sand. <laughs> he really lived, didn't he? He lived on 20. That's insane. Um, <laughs> yeah, now I just need to not take any damage with Otis. Which is easy, so... Especially since he'll die to the second attack I use. Or that one. <laughs> Bad dog. Index targeting time? Uh, I mean... It's an easy EX clear? I don't know, that was eight turns. If I had a worse team, it might not have been that easy. True. <laughs> I 맞아. 힌들리 오빠는 그때부터 히스클리프가 자신이 가진 모든 걸다 빼앗아 갈게 틀림없다고 시작했던 거구나. Isn't this a fifth one? I don't know. I haven't been counting. I'll be honest. 돌려줘. 돌려줘. 내 집도 바이올린도 내 미라도.
It was worth it. Was it? I don't know. He kind of died, didn't he? Oh, that doesn't surprise me in this case. <laughs> I'll be honest. Lotus was doing so bad. Matt. Oh, here we go. <laughs> They're within 10 turns. Unknown <laughs> resistances. Oh, epic. Oh, no. <laughs> Bad. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> this isn't Matt, huh? He did not seem to mind at all that his client had died right before him. This is problematic, probably. あ、もり俺来たらやはんで、すんがのっつに。目が高がぎ、ぶっかけに、最低ちょっと前に。ああ。ねえ、死んだけって。空の目が乗ったのにすぐ見せよ、俺。Where oh, are you talking about, Hindley? Okay. Stop singing the DK rap in my chat. <laughs> huh? Huh? What do you mean every time? Okay. Before anyone had the chance to stop him, Heathcliff bolted up to the machine and grabbed the dead rabbit's boss by his collars. <laughs> Yeah. Oh. ああ、ゆれこ。やれてみくのめたら減らんろ。けちょっとやねしかねなんでやんだ。What? <laughs> Okay, two boss fights in a row, huh? Uh, hmm. That's an awfully familiar pose. I have a theory. I have a theory. I don't want anybody to confirm or deny it. But something about this... That's Heathcliff, isn't it? No, I know don't look at chat. I'm just... I'm just thinking. That looks awfully similar to Heathcliff, doesn't it? I'm gonna read your passives. 
So apply one attack power up to two other allies with the lowest SP. For this encounter, gain a slot every time an ally is defeated. If the target's at current HP is higher than this unit's, clash power plus two and deal plus 20% more damage. Okay, that's only going to activate really late into the fight. Uh, clash win, heal five SP. Clash lose against Heathcliff. Lose five SP and gain two bind next turn. If this unit did not let a single hit against Heathcliff that turn, uh, lose five SP on turn end. Okay, so don't let him hit Heathcliff. On hit, inflict bonus pierce damage equal to 50% of the damage dealt. Cool. Uh, if not at negative 45 SP, heal 15 SP. If panicked, recover from panic at the t next turn start and reset SP to zero. If this unit recovers from panic, gain two attack power up at the start of the next turn. This unit's panic type does not change when inflicted with an effect that changes panic types. Instead, this unit is inflicted with an effect that is inflicted against targets without SP. Okay. <laughs> Epic. Uh, oh, good. Odd use gain one attack power up the next turn. My favorite. Uh... So what I took from that is do not let him hit Heathcliff. It doesn't look like there's any problem with killing the minions, though. How many turns did I have? Uh, it's ten turns, right? Same as the last fight? I mean, yeah, it, heal 15 SP every turn is basically the human equivalent to... Yeah, ten? Okay. That's what I expected, I just wanted to make sure. So just don't let him hit Heathcliff at all. He's not even targeting Heathcliff. <laughs> okay, that's fine then. Go for that guy. Please actually win the clash. That would be sick. Uh, and then I want to maybe kill one of the small rabbits if I can. Like, pretty quickly. Because that'll help out a lot. Epic. Um, okay, Rodia. Thanks for that. <laughs> well done. I love when that happens. You didn't even have any attack power up and Rodia still lost him. Bruh! Stop this. You gotta roll at least one heads. It's a 50% chance. Multiple times, in fact. Okay, bud. Okay, Matt. Okay. AKA Dead Rabbit's okay. boss. <laughs> At least stagger him. Heathcliff. <laughs> you always roll heads at zero sanity, man. Okay. Okay, now he wants to target Heath. Uh, Smackdown. Yeah, this is definitely just Heath. <laughs> He's literally an image of Heathcliff. Gain attack power up on Clash Win. Uh, five attacks. You're going to be the one to do that. I can't even really clash with him using Heath, because Heath needs to not do that. Uh, okay, can I please... Bruh. I know it's struggling, I'm gonna do it anyways. That'll work. And Heath clashes with this one. It is actually MatPat. Oh, it's a game theory? I didn't realize. My bad. <sighs> Did I forget to kill the guy? No, I didn't. I had uh, Hong Lu targeting him. I mean, there's still a pretty good chance he lives, but yeah, that's fine. We'll get him eventually. We'll get him eventually. Heathcliff <laughs> at negative 10 sanity? Really? Oh, I actually won the struggling clash. Sweet. It's actually really good. <laughs> I don't feel like this fight's gonna take 10 turns, but if I get really unlucky, it might. I haven't checked his weaknesses at all. I should probably... Oh, he resists Blunt. That's great. Uh, <laughs> it's actually fine. Oh, he resists all physical damage types. Cool. That's not annoying at all. <laughs> Wait. Okay, I need to do this against something. Oh, that that's favored? Why? I'll take it. Uh, yeah, an enemy resisting all physical damage types is only a little annoying. Uh, I need an actual good clash against that. 
so I will... I don't like the corrosion chance, but I'll still do it. Because I can. Yo, Yang, thank you for the 10 gifted. What the heck? <laughs> you don't need to do that. Oh, I gave him so much attack power up, didn't I? That's bad. I'll still win with Heathcliff's Clash. That's the important one. Yeah, thank you for the 10 uh, memberships, dude. <laughs> hit the AoE button. I could do that. It's true. I did hit the AoE button. I didn't even mean to. Oh, I corroded. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Can I kill this guy? Nah, no, he's not gonna die. That's unfortunate. He just barely didn't die. Who got staggered? Saying, or hungry did. Alright. He has two attack power up. That's like not great. <laughs> oh yeah, he had a passive that was hidden. What was it? If an enemy defeats an ally, gain one attack power up and one haste next turn. Three times per turn. Okay. It's kind of what I figured, but I needed to make sure. This is a good time for this, I think. I can't... Okay, fine. Neutral. Sucks that it's neutral. Still do it. This is gonna be struggling no matter what. You can't clash. <laughs> Epic, okay. I need somebody to kill that guy yet. That works. I, I don't even really care. Who's this targeting? Rodia? That's fine actually. That's okay. We'll still win this clash, trust. <laughs> See? He has three attack power up. There's no way I wasn't winning that clash. Like, come on. Have faith in me, chat. And by chat, I mean the game saying that my clash was struggling. But, you know. Okay. Yeah, it's okay. She can tank it. That actually was still a lot of damage. <laughs> Honestly. Now it becomes pain. No, we're fine. This is still okay. As long as I don't kill multiple enemies in the same turn, it's fine. Okay, now he's attacking a lot. I, I see. Uh, that's okay. Yeah, Greg is using bygone days. Definitely. Because I don't need sun shower right now, I hope. Jesus. Uh, dominating. That'll be the clash there. You suck. <laughs> so you'll be the guy that's targeting the guy that does not actually matter at all. Um, <laughs> it's okay. We're fine. Like, he's getting staggered, and so the fight is basically over. Hi, Biel. If only he took a dedicated Kanto for potential man to reach his full potential. You say that like he hasn't been last in damage every time I've brought him. <laughs> you didn't forget that he has a passive that says he gains attack slots when allies die? No, I didn't forget that. It just doesn't matter to me. It's gonna be the same number of attack slots either way, so who cares? And now he's staggered, so it actually doesn't matter. You know? I think we're gonna win, chat. Like, I really think you're blowing this a little out of proportion, perhaps. Like, we're doing fine. <laughs> this fight was easier than the... No, it wasn't easier than the last one, but it was pretty easy. I've been here since the human Hindley fight. <laughs> That's true. Hello, Drobe. Hello, Tifereth Scrub. There, see? This was easy. What are you talking about? Hard fight. Bruh. Come on. People just did the fight without sinking. It wasn't even- he was at positive sanity the entire fight. It wasn't a big deal. Okay, he wasn't bottom this fight. He didn't take a single point of damage. See, that's all you need to do in the fight, is just not let him take damage. Easy. The beast. Uh-oh. <laughs> We're not done, huh? Uh, <laughs> they're within 15 turn. Oh, it's a dongbake situation. Are you going to give me a 7th slot?
No. You're garbage. Okay. <laughs> and resistances? I mean, I don't see them. <laughs> Mr. Beast? Oh, no. Mr. Beast! No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yep. I knew it. Yeah, the head actually hates that, I think. An identity? Oh, I see. Okay. Okay. And who is that? Yeah, this is the V2 fight. <laughs> Wait. Where's the coroner reports, buddy? Yeah, I don't really understand... If it's somebody wearing Heathcliff's mirror self as an identity, then why does why is it actually Heathcliff? Heathcliff saw Heathcliff having friends and decided that he was here to piss. He was so pissed off that he manifested here. Alright, so all we have to do is kill you and then it's resolved. What? <laughs> I mean, he would take it seriously, right? You need to chill out. Lie await? No, it's lie in wait. Sorry. <laughs> No, my frames. <laughs> 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 
Joel, stop eating my frames. <laughs> Why is this happening now? <laughs> this is the worst time of ever. Like... <laughs> Yim did not like your grammar policy, so they took you. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Just you wait until Sun Shower Heath manifests to complete your ass in part three? I would hope hope not. What? What, are you disorting now? Though he looks just like Heathcliff, he appears beaten down, distraught, and insane. Heathcliff from another world mournfully roars Catherine's name. <laughs> Don, <laughs> please. Don counters the Kamikami out with her eye beams. <laughs> Heathcliff, unknown. Uh, alright, what do you got? Okay, Bat Bash, yep. Yeah. These are the same skills. Uh, he's gonna have something new, though. I'm not sure. All skills target Heathcliff. Wins encounter if Heathcliff dies. Oh, good. <laughs> if the target's current HP is higher than this unit, Splash Power plus two. Okay, again, that's not gonna happen frequently. Clash win, heal five SP on self. Clash lose against Heathcliff, lose five. Okay, that's the same. Uh, that's the same, that's the same. Okay, he just doesn't have... Oh no, he still has the 15 every turn. Okay. Does he do bonus damage against Heathcliff, though? No. Low morale, he gains defense level down and damage up. If an ally is defeated, increase by 15. Because gluttony resist? Wait. But he, I don't see it. What are you talking about? <laughs> Alright, well, I mean, I can still redirect stuff. So that's nice. Here, I'll just... Look um, that's a one-sided guard. Bruh. He has five speed. That's so annoying. It means I can only redirect one thing, which means Heathcliff is about to get hit pretty hard. What do you use this? Blunt? Actually, that's fine, then. I'll just take the stronger hit. In that case, and get a better clash. It sucks that he has, um, you know, we want to inflict Echoes of the Manor right away. I didn't read what the defense skill does. I assume it's the same as in the last fight. <laughs> Just bonk. <laughs> Ow, it's fine. You're kidding. <laughs> Why do you double heads, dude. So just don't let him kill Heathcliff and we'll be okay. That's all I need to do. That did not inflict Echoes of the Mana. Why didn't it? Is he just immune to it and it doesn't tell me? That's sick. Oh no, he's not immune to it. Uh... <laughs> what? When hit, gain offense level up and one defense level up next turn... Oh, defense level down next turn. But he's weak to wrath? Okay. Good thing that my team has so much wrath in it. Uh. <laughs> I mean, I guess I can use my counter. Against one of them. But I also kind of need to get sanity on everybody, is the other issue. 
Thank you, Hong Lu, for being reliable. I mean, I wish you would have rolled higher, but that's fine. <laughs> Yo, Rodia being good? Wait. <laughs> yeah, he's going to be at very low sanity now. Uh, <laughs> which is crazy, actually. <laughs> the offense level up isn't going to help him. So he has that effect for four turns, yeah. That's okay. Ow. Now perish. I actually did not do, like, anything. <laughs> it's okay. Panic Revenge, yep. So 9 offense level up isn't actually going to help him that much, thankfully. Oh my god, my speed is going nuts. That's not neutral. I know better. That might be neutral. <laughs> it's because I have a chance to flip tails. That's why. And I did, of course. <laughs> I can see this taking 15 turns, yeah. Being resistant to uh, every damage type except Wrath is definitely going to make it take a while to get to his first stagger. Okay. I was not expecting that to roll that high. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Rodia, for your assistance, I guess. I need sanity. Like, I might need to redo this and just bring stuff that I can fluid sack. Because at this rate, I'm not going to have enough sanity ever. Lose 5 speed and gain 5 defense level down. Why does he have this? <laughs> okay, I'll take it. Hey, yeah. Go ahead. Uh, I can use nothing, really. None of this stuff gives me sanity. Hang on. I need to check. Yeah, Land of Illusion only heals Hong Lu, so it's not as good. No, I want to take that with somebody who's not already neutral. Yeah, that'll work. Bro roll the heads at negative 45. Yeah, I know, I noticed. Uh, it was kind of mean. Um, I'll be honest with you, that was kind of rude of him. I could just rhyme shank this turn to be funny, but I think that's probably not the greatest of ideas, so I won't. Ooh, that was close. No! Bro. <laughs> You're kidding. Hong Lu, please. I need you to have sanity, chat. Oh, why does he have three attack power up, by the way? I just noticed that. <laughs> You're kidding. Dominating Clash, by the way. I'm gonna need to restart. Because he's just gonna kill me now. These were dominating clashes, by the way. I just want to point that out. The game is just lying to me, basically. I even staggered him, too. That's the worst part. None of this gives sanity. I need something to give me sanity, I guess. Because otherwise we're not getting through this in any amount of time, really. What turn is it? Six? What now? Oh, for God's sake. Well, Gloom is something I actually have, thankfully. Alright, Greg. I need you to use this just because I need sanity right now. <laughs> I can't clash. That's so cool. Oh my god. Why? When hit, inflict 3 SP damage on the attacker, gain 1 sinking count, and gain 1 offense level up. <sighs> okay. There's no way that's worth doing. Hopeless. Very cool. Can you please not? Actually, you know what? There. Now it's dominating. <laughs> Dude! 
Why? <laughs> the same thing happened again. Sun Shower heals SP? Yeah, but I would also corrode if I used it. Stop spamming in my chat. I know that Sun Shower heals SP, and it would be great if I used it for that, but if I used it, I would also corrode into Sun Shower and kill my team. Which, you know, isn't preferable. That was predictable, honestly. I need Yisag to have SP if I want to use Sun Shower ever. What now? <laughs> Why are you like this, Heathcliff? I absolutely cannot allow that to hit me. That's for sure. I almost don't even care if I corrode on Heath. Like, that's not a big deal. Corroding on anyone else is a big deal. I, I just can't do anything because of this. Do I have his passive activated? No, I don't. At least he wins a clash now, like... He has so much clash power, actually. It's kind of crazy. That attack is a run ender? I kind of figured. It, it kind of looked like it. It was a three-target skill, after all. Guard, don't care. I wasn't going to be able to break it anyways, because you sang bad. But this is an attack you basically are just required to use Ego against. I mean, <laughs> let's be real here. And then I'm going to Corrode next turn, which might be okay, honestly. This is fine. I'm going to take a bit of damage. I did not actually Corrode. He's doing it again? Well, now I can't Clash with it. Now I just need to stagger him before he uses it. This is not going well. <laughs> What do you mean struggling? That shouldn't be struggling at all. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Just try to stagger him, I guess. It's really my only chance is to stagger him, right? <laughs> oh, I should have been clashing more, because I forgot about the sinking, so I could have actually gotten some sanity back this turn. Oh well. There's the stagger. Jesus. This fight is not pleasant. <laughs> Mostly because I'm flipping tails on every single coin. Even though I'm at zero sanity. Thanks, game. <laughs> oh, and... Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Hoglu, for being good for once. Heathcliff from another world gl glares at Heathcliff. <laughs> every strand of vein in his bloodshot eyes are pulsating with burning hatred. Your puerile adventure ends here. Cast yourself off the cliffside of suffering. Let the sorrow agonize you until your body strikes the earth cold. This is the smallest atonement you could pay to Kathy as her murderer. Bastard, even now? Heathcliff bolts forward, unable to stop himself. Oh, are we stopping Heathcliff? Oh no, I have to click Heathcliff. Uh, something tells me I'm gonna lose this. Yep. <laughs> Heathcliff rushes forward, screaming, consumed with wrath, but perhaps the wrath got in the way of sound judgment. Heathcliff from another world was able to read his moves like an open book. A fatal counterattack smote Heathcliff. Heathcliff from the other world mutters that you are Heathcliff, who is reeling, kneeling from shock. Yeah, you might be right. I might just be a bloody wretch like you said, but I'll kill you first anyway. Heathcliff hasn't given up yet. The other sinners stand ready for battle as well. This is far from over. Very well. This is good, Heathcliff, isn't it? Resent me, hate me, do not relent, because this will be the start of your journey to kill every Heathcliff. A journey that ends in your demise. Together, we shall all plummet to the bed of this abyss. He bellows once again with anguish, the battle rages on. Heathcliff gains... Th uh, fr fragile, comma, three. <laughs> I hate... Dude, it's not that hard <laughs> to say three fragile. <laughs> Like, come on. Fragile, comma, three, comma, attack power up, comma, and three! <laughs> For the rest of the encounter. What? <laughs> gotta, 
Are you kidding me? <laughs> and three. <laughs> Incredible wording. What happens if you pass this check? <laughs> Suncliff with three? It's over. <laughs> All allies gain two damage up. Okay, this is going to be easy. Double the amount of stagger threshold raised, including the set effect from Tremor Burst for enemy Heathcliff. Why? Oh, for God's sake. He was staggered, dude. Okay. Why do I have soda equipped? <laughs> yes, that is the question I have right now. Um, Time to repent. Target fixed. That... Can I redirect it? No. Okay. It's worth checking. I mean... In theory, I win this clash, right? This is... This is gonna kill my turn count. Because now I'm just not gonna get the chance to use the stagger turn. And there's nothing I can do about it. That's incredible. That works. Uh... Do the favored one. You have three, so that's the best clash I have against that. Uh, and then you are not clashing, because I know better. Okay. I need to be able to use Bygone Days again. You're kidding. Okay, she won anyways. I'm honestly genuinely surprised that that won. <laughs> this one, it doesn't really matter if it wins the clash, I guess. Okay, I shouldn't have said anything. Because now I'm not going to win this. Knowing my luck. Actually, Hong Lu is just the best. Never mind. I don't have enough envy to take advantage of that weakness, by the way. Before anyone says anything. You can just kill him in six turns. I can. I, I probably will if I get lucky. I mean, it, it depends on how lucky I get, right? Okay, I need to use bygone days. I need to get some. It's not bygone days. Dang it. And I can't even sun shower right now either. That's the worst part. On a poke. Wait. Oh. Fix, fix targeting. Uh. <laughs> right. That's dominating somehow. Oh. Otis actually has sanity now. That's good. Now that I will need to use an ego against. I think. <laughs> Hold on. If overclocking it, I can't overclock it right now. It's fine. Uh, unopposed. I hate you. Because Heathcliff gets staggered if I let him get hit. But if I try to clash with that skill, I'm going to get fricked up. Right. No matter who does it. I mean... Favor. That means I need to rely on him not hitting heads every time. I could do it there... Have you clash with that? No, you... You're terrible. <laughs> uh, and then... Bat Bash... I need to have Rodia clash. There's no way around that. She's getting staggered and probably killed. That'll get me more sanity than I lose. When the days are not bygone. He doesn't have any tremor, so this doesn't really help. Dude. <laughs> You're kidding. I mean, it was a favored clash, not a dominating one this time, but that's still super annoying. Why did she win? <laughs> Come on, game. Be make sense. That's all I want, is for you to make sense. Are you winning? No. <laughs> no, I'm not. I mean, I might still get under 15 turns. This is a long fight, dude. As soon as I stagger him again, as long as he doesn't have another Earth reality check, I should be okay. Oh, we're doing this again? That's fine. I can just use AADD again. Yeah, frick you, Heathcliff from another dimension. Uh, <laughs> counter. 
Well, I don't want Hong Lu to get hit by it. <laughs> but I don't really have much of a choice, so... I gotta just use his ego right now. Because I can. Win a clash that I wouldn't otherwise be good at winning. Hopeless. That's so cool. Uh... Hopeless! Why? <laughs> like, actually, why this time? Not just me being pedantic. Oh, I didn't clash with one of his skills, did I? Why use Rupture when you can use Declare Open War <laughs> Paralysis? Oh, so I should have just taken it then. Yeah, I'll absorb your sinking, I don't care. Rhodia being reliable for once? Okay. Can we please stagger him before he, you know, <laughs> before he uses that attack on Heathcliff? Because I think if he gets that off, I just lose. Rousis is one hell of a drug? True. That didn't... No, it did stagger. I heard the noise. Rip his sanity, I guess. <laughs> did he just heal? Okay, three turns to deal 449 damage. Uh, You just hit him. You just hit him. Heathcliff can't use Ego this turn. I could Sun Shower. No, I can't. <laughs> Let's be real. There's no way I do enough damage this turn. I think Sun Shower might actually do more. Perhaps. But it sucks, because no matter what I do, he still resists... Oh, wait. He doesn't resist everything. Uh, He resists Gluttony, so I shouldn't use Gluttony. Got it. I can do that. Dude. <laughs> flip heads at all, really. Not you! <laughs> you don't need to flip heads. That's so rude, Heathcliff. <laughs> okay, I only need to do, like, a hundred more damage. In three turns. What are you doing now? Oh no. Well, Hong Lu is gonna die. I need to kill him before. I need to kill him before his attack goes off. That's literally it. Because I can't redirect that. I can only do one of them. At least he doesn't have any. Uh, sanity this turn. And then, just to be safe, I'm still gonna do this. <laughs> I think we're in the clear, though. He does two of those? I I'm assuming most people don't get this far into the fight. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, <laughs> because otherwise people would know that. Just max damage, you are faster. I know. I'm aware. That did 10 damage. <laughs> so incredible. This'll do more. Maybe not. Dude, I need to start flipping heads. Come on. I don't know if this does enough damage. And if it doesn't, I i mean, he'll flip tail. Nice tails roll, he flip. It's enough. <laughs> I did three damage more. Yeah, I didn't expect him to end the animation. Good. Level, by the way, level 40 EX clear, for the record. 
내게 사실대로 들려줘 그러니까 어, 어떻게 캐, 캐시가 죽었는지 평소처럼 다정한 얼굴로 눈을 감았어? 어린 양처럼 조용히 돌아가셨어 그 애가 내 이야기는 아니었어? 그럴 수가 없었어 캐서린 아가씨는 잠든 채로 영면하셨으니까 얼굴에 다정한 미소를 띠고 누워계셨지 평온한 꿈속에서 안식을 맞으셨을 거야 부디 평화롭게 잠드시기를 시가 <웃음> 고통 속에서 비참하게 깨어나기를 아, 뭐라고? 내, 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 내가 내가 캐시를 죽인 거야 그렇지 캐시 유령이 돼서 나를 찾아와 네가 없는 시면에 나를 내버려 두지 말고 난 혼자서는 도저히 살수 없어 히스클리프! 캡시! 너는 내가 살아있는 한 편히 쉬지 못할 거야! 나 역시 녹화랄 테고! Why'd you leave Wuthering Heights? It's where the love of your life lives, isn't it? 그래, 쉬게 되거리. 그런 질문을 했었지. 근데 왜 떠났냐는 질문보다는 버티고 있던 이유를 물어보는 게더 맞았을 거야. 나를 향한 매질과 조롱과 멸시와 모든 고통, 굶주림은 견딜 수 있었어. 참으면 되는 것이었으니까. 언제나 하던 것이고. 그럼에도 불구하고 버텨냈던 워더링 하이츠를 떠나기로 결심했던 이유는 깨달았습니다. 그래서 린트는 곧 부자가 될 거고 린튼과 결혼한다면 나는 이 근방에서 가장 잘나가는 발명가가 되겠지? 어쩌면 시사 올해의 발명가상을 받을지도 몰라 그러면 히스클리프는요 아가씨? 넬리 무슨 말을 하는 거야? 히스클리프와 함께 한다면 내 품위는 떨어지고 말 텐데 So, uh, the mirror world Heathcliff that we just killed is the Heathcliff that is the one that's literally the novel I believe, then, if I'm assuming correctly. I saw you, Carmen. Don't echo your voice.
모든 귀소리는 반드시 불행해지게 마련이었다. 디스 클리퍼로 인해서. 자, 봐라. 모든 가능성 세계의 박산들을! 그 어느 세계에서 히스클리프는 캐서린의 마음을 찢어놓고 비참하게 죽도록 만들지! Chill, dude. Chill, dude. Chill, dude. Chill, dude. 내가 돌아왔다고 캐시 넌저 모습을 보면 어떤 생각이 들어? 이게 사람이 할 행동인가? 그저 사람 모양 가죽만 뒤집었을 속은 쓰레기로 가득한 농막처럼 동생 캐넨 이벤트 모먼트 내가 바뀌었다고? 바뀐 모습을 보여줄 거라고? 버림도 없었어 애초에 성립이 안 되잖아. 나는 사람조차 되지 못했는데. Is that five or six? 히스클리프, 너는 나를 어떻게 생각해? 인간의 말을 할 필요는 있나? 캐서린을 죽게 만든 너는, 캐서린을 나로부터 아사가 버린 너는, 신승만도 못한 존재일 텐데. 그래서 인간과 필요가 있을까? 그 새끼들이 말했던 것처럼 말이 안 통하는 짐승이 되어버렸다면 주인에게 버려진 울부짖으며 날뛰는 슬픈 사냥개 그게 지금 너만의 마음이고 되고 싶은 모습이구나 맞아 난 지옥의 사냥개가 되어서 도시를 향해 짓고 전부 찢어 발겨 저러 안에 담아 끌고 다닐 거야. 나와 캐시를 이 꼴로 만든 그 모든 것들을 저주하면서 너의 바람대로 될수 있어. 캐시, 너 발목이. 내가 꼭 돌아올게. 나. <laughs> Why the noise? <laughs> Why the otherworldly scream? <laughs> What's up with that? Oh, he did the most damage. <laughs> I guess that's fitting. I took a lot of damage in that fight, huh? <laughs> That's not good. What an epic... <laughs> what an epic cliffhanger. And it's only part two? Well, part three is just the dungeon. It only took seven attack power up. Did you see how close I was to not killing him there, by the way? He had 22 health. I did 25 damage with ADD. <laughs> what a ghetto, huh? It's not done yet. <laughs> That's insane. Um, Keith Cliffhanger. <laughs> the skill 2 would have wiped. Yeah. No, I had guaranteed, like, 30 damage from Rupture. So, what do you mean it's only part C? I don't know. That's a pretty good sequence of fights, honestly. What is it? Regular Hindley, Distorted Hindley, Heath... No. Regular Heathcliff... I mean, I guess this is technically also just regular Heathcliff, if we really think about it. Um... <laughs> I could forgive them for not making April Fools with such a canto. Well, I mean, I would I don't even care about April Fools. <laughs> I'll be honest. 
Uh, waiting for the inevitable Cobalt Scar Heathcliff in the next full Fulpurgis knock. That's not inevitable at all. <laughs> what are you talking about? Above average Heathcliff, bruh. <laughs> Don't call him that. <laughs> yes, go into Mirror Dungeon and trigger some loading screens. I will. <laughs> the issue is that I don't want to do a mirror dungeon right now because it's not past the daily reset yet. I've got 15 more minutes for that. Did you see last April Fools? Yeah. <laughs> the four Carmen flashbacks. I know, I saw those two. I don't like this ID, by the way, Chet. I really hate it. Honestly, I think we would have been doing so much better if I just brought Harpoon. Just look at the loading screens. I can make loading screens show up elsewhere, you know? It is inevitable. I look through all the Mirror of Possibilities and it's a 100% chance the Cobalt Scar Heathcliff is coming next while Burger is knocked. You're just a liar. Cry about it? Excuse me. <laughs> what do you mean? That idea is peak. No, it's really not. <laughs> that fight is very reminiscent of just Gaff's Harpoon, by the way. With all the ways that it freaks you up. Just annoying. Uh, and yeah, that was the EX clear, wasn't it? Yeah. At least it does give you 15 turns. I think that minus 10 sanity would have messed with Harpooner real bad. I don't think it would have. Because you would have had more sanity in general. Had fun using Sun Shower for a change. I mean, it's nice to be able to use the ID, but wouldn't it be cooler if we could use it anywhere? Should have not only made Heath mandatory for the fights, but specifically <laughs> Sun Shower? No! No, absolutely not. What did Eloy say? I can't find it. Oh, wait, there it was. Uh, Cobalt Scar Heathcliff is very much inevitable. No. <laughs> no, it's just not. It was sitting 0 SP max the entire fight. Okay. <laughs> Got his potential. It's not even. No, that's the thing. My uncle at PM said we will get a funeral of dead butterfly Heath <laughs> I really. That's honestly more likely. But can we get some Ruina IDs, though? What is Cobalt Scar? Cobalt Scar is the ego from Big and Might Be Bad Wolf. Used Yisang and Middlemer so for the SP heal? Which Yisang? <laughs> Our Heath can't do the check. Epic. <laughs> He's the only one with matching skill affinities for it. Heathcliff is going to have a Hindley ID. That's the thing. Dong Juan ID when? Never. I don't even remember who that is. <laughs> oh, that's the grade one fixer guy. In the last fight on my first attempt towards the end, he was outspeeding all my units, so I took all of them on Heath, aka I lost instantly after having an easy time. Oh, good. <laughs> Daredevil Cherry Blossom Ryoshu. Well, we were getting a Butler Ryoshu. Honestly, Sinclair Ryoshu and Heathcliff have IDs for this season. So what'll probably happen is Yisang will get the two-star, and... Rodeo will get the three star, I'm guessing? That seems most likely in my mind. Did you see the golden hair in the pile of flesh heath? Uh, yeah, I did. But yeah, I think Yisang will get the two star, Rodeo will get the three star. Or maybe Merceau will get the three star because he got an ego. Um, it makes you think that they will not just do a Heathcliff ID. We know that Heath. What are you talking about? <laughs> you are not cooking. What about Merceau? Oh, Merceau already got an ID. Never mind. <laughs> oh, that just confirms that electric screaming is rupture, by the way. <laughs> it's 
not gonna be a Heathcliff. We know that Heathcliff is Hindley in the mirror in the mirror world we're getting IDs from. <laughs> Well, my cousin's wife's brother's aunt's roommate's boss's maid is psychotic, which is close enough to psychic, says we're getting that. <laughs> uh, Heathcliff as... No, I don't want that. It would be cooler if we don't get it because we just destroyed it, didn't we? So that ID won't exist anymore. Like, what do you mean where? We know where. Have you ever looked at this art? This is Heathcliff. You want more proof? Okay, I'll just look at Faust's pre uptie art, shall I? This is Heathcliff. This isn't Hindley, chat. <laughs> this is absolutely Heathcliff. It's literally his portrait. This is Gregor. We know that. All I'm saying is, the next banner we're getting is two-star Sinclair Butler, three-star Ryoshu Butler, and then sometime, like, immediately after Railroad 4, we're getting this Heathcliff. Heathcliff is wolf. Alright, chat. Let me just... Let me just show you something real quick. Let me just show you something real quick. <laughs> You know who else is literally a wolf? That's Hindley. <laughs> yeah, I know they name drop Heath as the one that they're hunting, but you know what else they did? They just had us destroy the Heath ID that is Heathcliff. <laughs> and at no point did they refer to this Heathcliff as a wolf. There can be two? No. No, there really can't. <laughs> That's a dog? I don't know if you knew this, but dogs and wolves are basically the same genetically. <laughs> Anyways. Look at these resistances, by the way. I never found out his pride resist. That's okay. Stop listening to Carmen. I'm not. Right? You haven't seen a distortion of me. You wouldn't like that. Anyways, I'm done for now. <laughs> That's all. That's all we need to do. Thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. That was cool. That was a good update. I liked that. The boss fights were a little bit unnecessarily tanky, I feel like. Uh, I would rather them have fewer stagger thresholds and just not have a billion defense. But oh well. <laughs> But yeah, thank you all for coming out. I'll see you all next week when the thing is done. And we'll know what the next IDs are. And trust me, I know what they are. Uh, my dad works at Project Moon. So I hope you have a good rest of your weekend. See you later. <laughs>